Hi, this is Matt Hamrick from the Homebrew Mobile Phone Club, and uh, this is my video blog where I'm going to show some of the uh, progress we've made on uh, making our my phone. Oh yeah, by the way, the reason there's no light for uh, this production is that it's hyper late at night. Um, check that out. There's my son. He's totally asleep. Um, 101. One o'clock in the a.m. and uh, Adrian and I were up at uh, up until one o'clock last night too, trying to get this stuff to work. And um, so yeah, let me show you what I've got. Okay, see that? That's a keyboard. That's um, the keyboard from uh, my Mac G5 that doesn't work especially well. Uh, thank you, Apple. Um, oh, get up in the air. Okay. Uh, there is a female to female USB adapter going into the Apple uh, keyboard and uh, then it goes on the other side it goes into a um, I can't remember what you call that kind of USB plug uh, that standard USB plug uh, doo -doo 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 -doo, cable goes doo -doo 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 -doo, into the mini USB plug um, oh yeah these things uh, apparently they're hard to find you can buy them from the gum sticks website um, okay, so then where um, we go into the console VX, which has uh, a gumsticks vertex on top of it, um, coming out of the console VX in the middle uh, serial port is a cable which goes to my Macintosh that you can see that I'm recording this on. Um, yeah, there's the terminal display that will soon prove that. Um, I'm actually booting this stuff. Oh, my son's waking up. Um, anyway, so let's hurry up with this. Uh, yeah. God, it's pretty gosh darn late. And I'm starting to babble to myself. Um, okay. Okay. I just turned on the power. Oh, look at that. The screen is working. Look at that. I'm getting stuff from the serial port as well. That's so cool. Okay, let's see what happens here. <gasps> if you know anything about Linux, you know that this is a login prompt. Okay. Um, okay, this is highly technical. Okay, you may not realize this, but um, if you get a login prompt, one of the things you can do, as I mount this on top of my head, is you can type the root password. Maybe what else I should do is I should come here and G U M S T I X. Let's see if I can spell that. Oh, it looks like I can't spell. It's pretty late. R O O T G U M S T I X. There we go. We logged in. Do an LS. Oh, there's nothing there, actually. Go to CD dot dot. LS. Oh, you're probably not going to be able to see. Um, my guess is is that YouTube uh, really doesn't store these videos in the uh, appropriate resolution so that you can actually see that that is, uh, well, you know, it's I just did an LS on Slash. Anyway, hey, so that's where we're at. Stuff is happening. Um, next thing we're going to work on this thing right here, that is a Goliath board. Uh, I had a little bit of problems uh, getting this to, to come up. Um, Adrian and I are gonna work on it in the morning. Um, I believe what the problem is is that um, the version of Linux, the version of Linux kernel that we flashed into, uh, into that gumsticks flash um, was for a 600 megahertz part and I kind of realized that that's a 400 megahertz part, so maybe it has something to do with the fact that uh, I can't get the screen to come up on the uh, on the Goliath, but I can get it to come up on this um, this thing, the console VX. So uh, yeah, so stuff's happening. Anyway, um, yeah, that's it. All right, take care. Bye bye. Uh, Okay, how do I stop this?